Okay, we've now got the unit one, the AQA, that's the foundation paper, but this is the specimen paper, or the specification paper. So, let's look at question one. It says that the three students take the same test. The test has 20 questions, and each question has one mark. And to pass the test, you need to get 70%. And we need to just um, find out these three people, Eleanor, Clyde, and Alfie, for part C, to find out whether the things are true or false. Uh, Ellen had 10 questions correct. Well, all you need to say, 10 out of 20 is 50%. Uh, and then she obviously, if she only got 50% and the pass mark was 70%, she failed the test. Nice easy mark to get off with. Next one said, I had three quarters of the questions correct. I had three quarters of the questions correct. Well, three quarters of the questions is, well, you know that three quarters, or you should do, is 75%. If you say something like three quarters, 75%, um, then you can instantly see that uh, you passed the test. Another easy mark. Let's go on to part C. Now, I've just copied the, the words across because it goes across the page otherwise. This time, Alfie got uh, exactly 70%. And it asks you how many questions uh, did Alfie answer correctly? Well, if you got 70%, um, well, let's just think about one question. If a question's got 20, 20 questions, to get to 100%, each question must be, um, well, that's 100, that's 100 percent, 100 percent is getting all 20 questions right. So if you've got 10 percent of the paper right, you get two questions correct. So then all you've got to do for Alfie is you see that you've got to do 10 percent times 7 to get to 70 percent. So you've got to just do 2 times 7, which means you've got 14 questions Correct. There are a couple of other ways of doing it. I like to think of it as if you've got everything right, 100%, therefore every uh, two questions or every one question is worth 5%. That's how you can think of it as well. 5% uh, is one question. Now, then you just need to work out how to get up to 70%, which in this case is easy. Nice two marks. And that's it. Finish the first question.